Microsoft published a new Copilot, which is part of Copilot for Microsoft 365. Copilot in stream, which will help you to analyze your videos. In this video, I will focus on the area how to use Copilot in stream on the daily basis, what the really stream is, especially modern way, and how to go from the video that you get from somebody to automatically generated transcript and the analysis of the content using AI assistance. Sounds interesting? Check the rest of the video. Moreover, if you want to learn more about Copilot, check my course I prepare for everyone. This is materials available for free. The only thing you need to do is to register using the link on the screen or in the description. And as always, I would like to ask you for help. If you will like this video, please leave the thumbs up. If you want to get the notifications about the new videos, please subscribe. If you have any questions, use the comment section. So let's start to talk about Copilot in stream. For the very long time, we had two streams in the area of the video services in Microsoft 365. Right now we have one modern Microsoft stream application which is more or less video player and editor management of the videos stored in SharePoint Teams or OneDrive, but it works more like Word Online. This is some kind of player tool on top of the video, but it doesn't care where the videos are stored or how the access rights are provided for this specific video. You can store your video files in Teams, in SharePoint, in the OneDrive and open them in Microsoft Stream as a player. And to be fair, you should be prepared already that in top of Microsoft 365 and Microsoft Teams, a lot of meetings, a lot of trainings will be recorded. The video will be stored for the future reference to share with people that for any reasons were not able to join or to build some kind of knowledge base for the future reference or just to get back to that video in the future. And if the video is very short, two, three minutes, you can always speed up the tempo, how fast the, word, the video is played. But if you want to really analyze very long video today, you did not have too much tools till this moment to do that. But thankfully, using Copilot in stream, you will be able to analyze the videos with few clicks using AI Assistant. So as we already mentioned, Microsoft Stream will be the application in Microsoft 365 where you will find all the videos. Also, if you're uploading your videos from the phone, you can catch your dog biting the bone. But if you're thinking about analyzing of the videos that you prepared, you can try to open the video that you already recorded, maybe about backup helping in the phishing situations, and you can see, you will need to have the video transcript to get the possibility to work with the copilot. This is very important because you need to remember that large language model is based on the text. So copilot will be able to help you whenever the transcript will be in place. And if you're working with Microsoft Teams inside your organization, you're recording the video, most of the cases transcript will be there. There could be the situation challenging where you will get the video shared with external party, then most probably transcript will not be attached. Thankfully, if you will go to video settings and transcript, you will get the possibility to generate or upload the transcript for your videos. You will need some time to do that. After this few minutes, automatically transcript will be generated for your video. This is very useful functionality, something new added to Microsoft Stream in the modern version, so be aware of that. When our transcript will be ready, we can get back to Copilot and we will have capability to analyze the video. And of course, the first thing I always recommending where you work with AI assistants, let's analyze what is in there. And in the moment we get the summary of our video, what are the key topics addressed and how the split 
of this video looks like. You can see this is very useful, especially if you don't have the transcript from Microsoft Teams. Some are here working very well. You can also ask any questions like, is backup really must have for Microsoft 365? Copilot will analyze the video and will try to answer this question. And you can see we get the feedback that speaker in this case myself telling that backup is not must have but still there are a lot of elements important for that case. So you can see Copilot can also interpret what is included in the content of the video. We can also ask Copilot to list action items. So what we should do after watching this video, something very similar to action items from the meeting. And in this video, I asked to test AFI AI in free trial, prepare plan and policies for the scenarios after ransomware attack and use Defender to secure your organization. Moreover, you can ask about an element that could be included in the video where this part of video is located. In this case, I ask about the retention policies that are included in the video and we have the timeframes where especially we're talking about that. So you can see this is the solution that really allows you to analyze the content of the video which don't have to be recording. Maybe this is just the video shared by third party vendor or meeting recordings provided by external party. You can generate the transcript, you can analyze that data. I hope this video helped you to understand how you can use Copilot in stream. Moreover, how you can use stream to generate the transcript for the videos that are not created in Microsoft Teams but maybe share with somebody else. Use that tool, start to analyze your videos and save a lot of time thanks to finding the key elements in the recordings that you will be interested in. If you have any questions about Copilot, check the comments and thank you very much for watching. See you in the next video.